Hey folks, Dusty here. This is section 9 of my series on keratology, POC number 7. If you want to follow along in sequence, check out the playlist I created. Welcome to 33 Degrees of Keratology, POC number 7, Abandoned Victimhood. Just like in the last video, the same is true for yourself. Are you your biggest cheerleader or saboteur? Your mindset determines a lot about how far you go in life, how many obstacles you put in front of yourself, and whether or not you find true happiness. If you're always negative and always blaming other people for your troubles, you'll always find trouble. By being a perpetual victim, you're allowing whoever you're blaming to have full control over your life. You are granting them full access to control your next move, decide how much money you will make, where you live, and what your station in life will become. You're giving them full reign to determine at what level your life will plateau and allowing them free room and board in your head. Your focus is not on yourself, it's on them. The worst part about this is you're probably making them feel better about themselves because most likely they're miserable. And what does misery love most? Yes. Misery loves company. This is how the herd mentality works. They want you right there with them, wallowing in self-pity, because it's more fun to have someone to ride or die with. The ugly truth about this scenario is that they're probably secretly blaming you for their problems. Why? Because they're victims themselves. And nobody can be a victim without a scapegoat. It's a revolving relationship going round and round the toilet bowl at a slower than agonizing pace, dragging out your demise even more. Does this sound familiar? Do you know someone like this? Or a whole family like this? It's an all too familiar scenario, and unfortunately, it can be genetic. I would even say it's a mental disorder. To fix it, you must give up the victim mentality. Be prepared though, because they will still blame you for leaving them in their misery. That's all for today, folks. In our next section, video 10, we'll talk about paying the bills. So, I hope you'll follow along. If you like this series so far, and don't want to miss the next section, be sure to subscribe. I add a new video to the series each week. Thanks for watching. As always, folks. Take the trip and enjoy the ride.